Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nairi, also known as Wedding Fashion Expert. Today, I am taking you behind the scenes on how I pack for a work trip. I'm headed to Engage Summits, which is a luxury event. And just to give you the proper explanation of exactly where I'm going, Engage is a luxury wedding and event business summit bringing thought leaders together at the world's top locations. So we are headed to the Breakers in Palm Beach. I'm so excited. What's really unique about these events is we get to have all these beautiful industry professionals, so many incredible, talented brains that get to come together in one space. We get to party, we get to spend time, we listen to incredible speakers, education. It's just a really well-rounded event. It's three days of intensity in the best way you could possibly imagine. We also have themes and we have certain events throughout those three days where we have outfits for. So what I've laid out here are all of my outfits. So it's a total of six outfits, three day outfits, three evening outfits. And because I like to work out, I'm also taking gym clothes. The reason why I'm making this video is because I only travel carry on because for one, I just want it to be easy, convenient, and I'm on the go. I don't want to have to think about waiting for my luggage. Did my luggage make my connecting flight? Whatever it may be. So I'm taking you behind the scenes in terms of how I pack all this clothes. I mean, we're talking evening gowns. Like I have gowns that I'm packing all in a carry on. I have four pairs of shoes that I'm taking and I have one, two, three, four bags that I'm taking. I'm actually a little nervous about this one because I've never taken four purses before. I usually try to make it so that all my outfits can match the same bag. Like maybe I'll take two bags, but taking four seems excessive. However, because there's themes, not everything matches the same exact outfit. And let's face it, I'm in fashion. I got to bring all the looks. So I'm going to show you all the pieces that I'm bringing and then now you're gonna to get to watch me pack it into the luggage and each day I'm going to put on an outfit and you get to see the theme and what I'm wearing to each look during this event. Hang tight for just a second. Let me reset up so you can see all the items. Here are the four bags that I'm taking on the trip with me and I can't wait for you all to stay tuned once I get to Palm Beach and you get to see these four bags styled with all my different looks. Here are the four shoe options that are coming on the trip. So this is everything that I'm packing. I have night one here, night two, night three, my three day looks, day one, two, and three. And then all my workout clothes right here, just some shorts and sports bras. These are all my undergarments. I am obsessed with these packing cubes. They are compression packing cubes and I will link them for you in this video. It's everything. It's how I pack a carry-on and compress all my items into being really, really compact. There are bathing suits there. I'm taking four, not gonna need that many. I have a tendency to overpack even with a carry-on, which is insane. This is just a random dress taking for fun, just back up if I want to have something pajamas. And here is a bathing suit cover and another bathing suit cover underneath over here. So this is my luggage that I will be using. It is the largest capacity carry-on luggage I have been able to find. It does have a little extender if you check it in on your way back or whatever, it does have that option. So I do like that it, it expands if necessary. So to maximize space ultimately in this luggage, it has some hollow components inside where I put my hair iron in there and then also my round curling brush for when I blow dry. I am obsessed with my Dyson blow dryer and can't live without it. I would really like them to make a travel size. That would be absolutely awesome. So this will hide under here as well. And then, so because my undergarments are already in here, I'm gonna just close this up and show you how I do the compression. So you just do that. And there's one packing cube down. So essentially I'm gonna roll everything up, put it in the packing cubes, and then I will show you the finished product when it's all done.
moment of truth. I put everything in. I threw in a little tripod just for selfies and things like that. I've got a little ring light hiding in here that I can recharge. Threw in a last minute dress over there. All right, so we'll zip this up. And I also have protein shakes hanging in here. I have pre-packet protein shakes so that I can get some nutrition in the morning first thing. In here, I have, so this is considered my personal item that fits under the seat. This is how I'm really able to do the whole carry-on thing. I have my laptop. I have this organizer. Organizer is also available on Amazon. I'll link it for you all. Laptop, products, makeup, steamer, all my electronic chargers, everything go in here. Okay, so here's where I'm nervous because so many bags and shoes that I don't typically take. Here are the two heels that I have. So it will go kind of, let's actually do clutch down here. The heels will go this way. Oh my God, it fits. <laughs> I can't believe it. Honestly, I always pack carry on, but like this is, this is next level. Like I'm to the brim with everything. And then this will be my handbag that I'm carrying. And technically you can only have two items. So I'm just gonna like toss it on top and kind of like hide it. But this will fit under the seat. This will go in the overhead bin. I'm not taking more overhead bin space from anybody else. I did it. I'm actually impressed by myself on this one. All right, I'll see you guys in Palm Beach. This is why I do not check luggage. And also important to build status with an airline. Made it on the flight. Time for engage. After nine and a half hours plus of travel, made it to my room. And there's the luggage. So I traveled in workout clothes because my logic is, is that I was going to work out once I landed, but it's already nine o'clock. I haven't really had a proper meal, so I'm going to go ahead and grab some dinner with a friend. This is the bag that I carried today. I'm obsessed with my little AirPod holder. So easy to get in and out of. Let me quick show you guys the bathroom. And it's actually a really nice size bathroom. I'm not mad at that one bit. And I cannot wait to see this property in daylight tomorrow. I didn't show how I pack all my cosmetics, but this is everything. This was all what was in my handbag and then on top of it I put the shoes and everything in the Louis Vuitton handbag. So here are all my products. I'm about to clean my makeup brushes because I didn't have time. Blow dryer, hair iron, all of that. So anyway, this is all of the products. It's a lot. <laughs> all right, see you tomorrow, day one. Here we go. So I've got outfit number one on. I am headed to registration. There's a gifting suite that I'm headed to along with the opening seminar. So excited. I have to get my jewelry on, quick get a belt with it and throw shoes on. The outfit is complete. I've got my belt, necklaces, jewelry, rings, bag, shoes. I am ready to start Engage Summit in Palm Beach. So excited, can't wait to meet everyone. And I will be back later for the look for this evening, can't wait. Had a remarkable afternoon. Now I'm heading to the welcome reception evening party. And the theme is bold prints, caftans, really loose and flowy things. So this is the dress that I opted for. A cute little back, handbag, matching shoes, same jewelry as earlier. So far, it's been such a remarkable engage. I'm a lot of breath because I'm rushing. Um, it's just been incredible. So much inspiration, incredible speakers. Just, we've all had a moment to sort of reflect on what's happened with COVID and what it means for all of us to be together and that we've survived. Just so much to be grateful for and thankful for and a room of so many phenomenal creatives and minds and just eye-opening expansion, creativity, flowing, fashion, fun, brilliant, smart. So it's just been really incredible. I'm really looking forward to this evening. 
this is the last outfit of the day and I will see you all tomorrow. And the first look of day two, opted for this really flowy, effortless, super comfortable dress, got some sleeves. It's really kind of long, hard to fit it in the screen, but these are my shoes, bag. Day two evening look. The theme is let your soul glow. We've had a great day listening to some phenomenal speakers. Now we're all dressed up, sparkling in outfits that we've been wanting to wear and haven't been able to because of COVID and quarantine. This is the bag I'm carrying, shoes. I'll back it up so you can kind of see the whole look. I'm looking forward to an evening of dinner and dancing the night away. Final day of Engage Summits, day three. This is my morning slash day look. Got belt, my little saddle bag, AirPod holder, all the equestrian feels today. Shoes to match. So this is my day look. We have the big gala tonight, which is Bridgerton themed. Super excited for the final evening of celebration. And I've just met so many incredible people. I've had the best time having really heartfelt personal conversations, business con conversations. It's so random of who sits next to you and how and why. So anyway, I am headed off to listen to some incredible speakers. It's the last speaking sessions of the trip and then we get a breakout afternoon session and then we have the gala later tonight. So I am so looking forward to it. Final day look. The final night is finally here for the gala Bridgerton theme. This is my look wearing V Chapman. So excited to rock this wearing black pumps super classic. Thanks for tagging along. Final outfit of the trip. I fly back to LA tomorrow morning. Thanks for tuning in, seeing all of my really fun outfits to go with the theme of each day, evening, afternoon, you name it. This is such a spectacular event. It's not all about the outfits, although for me, everything always comes back to fashion. It's been an incredible week meeting, brainstorming, just learning from so many phenomenal, talented people within the wedding space. And it's just a true honor and a privilege that I've had the opportunity to be here and to take you all along with me on this little fashion story journey while here at Engage in Palm Beach. See you in next week's episode.